Welcome everyone back to the channel. We are in episode 5, day 6 of the Wukong Chase, day 6 of this account's life. And uh, I decided to stand up. It's uh, Normally I would do this the first thing in the morning. I had some uh, long weekend woes to deal with, so I uh, jumped on that right away. It's lunchtime. Just finished lunch. I thought it would be a great opportunity to stand up. That's why I got this desk to keep the blood flowing, keep the back straight. So we are uh, ready to go. Let's see what we get here. There's a nice little final piece of... Don't care. Don't care. We do not care about funds here. Let's take a look. I haven't even had a chance to look what's happening today. Um, yeah, I, okay, so many people just, hey, I have an idea for your channel, would love to chat. Okay, would it send me, don't, okay, <laughs> chat. I'm not going to call you on the phone. My God, what's happening in Raid today? Let's find out the latest Raid news. Uh, Raid Shadow Legends, September 5th. Are we expecting something big to come in the game today? Trying to plan your content? Well, Hell Hades, I assume that something big would be the Primal Shards. Uh, lore, Sacred Order. Hey, let's give a newest welcome. A bunch of content creators are hitting that 1,000 mark now. We'll probably fill in the gap of some of the big old time timers that have decided to move on. Nothing new. No, no crazy new announcements today. So there's that. Get that out of the way. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Something stuck in my throat. Thank you to my referrals. Thank you. We do have a Jamarsa. I'm going to save Jamarsa for when I think I need her. Which is probably not right now. But I will. She's really good for progression. So uh, that's a champion that I think I will uh, will definitely build out. But I think we got Wukong. We got Kale. We got Deacon. Those three at least, probably before her. And she might be very useful to get during a summoning, summoning rush. So I think there's on one on right now. So I technically could, but we don't want to. Also, we're, I'm trying this. I'm trying this neat thing where I actually save my XP. This is one of the worst uh, money sinks or, or, or uh, gem sinks. Is that extra XP? Because when you're building early on, you want XP boost up all the time you want a full xp boost and if you don't have that xp boost you're really just wasting resources in campaign and so i want to make sure that's up so we're trying to save those you can see one week one day i've been failing <laughs> uh summon rush here we're probably uh by probably i mean absolutely not partaking i don't even honestly know if we'll unless no i don't think i'll actually partake in the um, in any shard openings, even at two times, or uh, until I have a sizable amount, like there's the extra legendary. That's a great early game event, but I only have seven shards, and it's during a 10x, so not a really good time for me. Uh, guaranteed extra. I think I want to, if I can, save up for that. I think that's my goal. Still can't do anything about those. News, mark is red. So uh, yeah, so that's kind of our that's kind of my game plan, my goal. I did do a little bit of work last night on the account. A little bit, I mean a lot of it actually. I'm at, again, I'm at this kind of stuck place where I don't want to waste any uh, resources on champions right, until Sun Wukong. He's the first, as far as when I say resources. I mean chickens and 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 both. I have one four star, but also just regular uh, food. But I am upgrading skills all the time. He's almost done, actually. Crazily enough, he's got one more to go. Um, we don't we got one cooldown here, which is nice. It's actually. It, it, it actually isn't too bad. Uh, we do, of course, need books in all of this. That leech. It's a good question. Is if I have leech, will will that be enough? I guess for nukers it will. 
Probably not for for clan bosses. What I'm thinking is is leech going to be enough to sustain, or do I need do I need to have life steal? That's a good question. Uh, what is it? What is it? It's thirty percent versus eighteen, or what? How does what is how does leech work? I don't know how leech works. I don't even know where. Actually, the worst part is I don't know where to find that information. And so it's always fun going through. Oh, you know what? It's th and I know where it is. I know where it is. I know where it is. It's in here. Um, payments. Is it in here? Game modes, champions, artifacts, events, additional features, bosses, clan. No. Guides in FAQ. No. Um, is there not a place where we can just learn about abilities? Let's try debuff. List of buffs and debuffs. And there we go. Is this even current? Ooh, it's got taunt in there. It's a good sign. Doesn't have doesn't have polymorph. Boom. It's it's an ability as well as a blessing. You gotta get it in there. 18% of the inflicted damage. I thought that's what it was, but I just wanted to double check. So 18% of the inflicted damage. That's like just under half of 30%. But 30% often heals them well past what they need. Right? Because when you, on Clan Boss, when you get the big, I don't know. Maybe we'll test it and then we'll, we'll see where we got to go. I mean, we got to get Masteries. Uh, I'm gonna save up for masters. Another another tip is uh, to to make life easier on you. Uh, buy your first one, maybe two champions their masteries. You'll start to get a lot of free gems in this game, in amongst the challenges and the missions. So, third stage one or higher, the minotaur. Okay. I don't think we have to do level one though. Let's keep going. Uh, I don't want these two to get scrolls. He can get scrolls, though. And I don't think he can get scrolls. Is that right, if I recall? Or he can only go up to, like, level four or something? Coffee. I have a feeling with Sun Wukong, I might not need to buy... We'll see. When we get him up leveled up, we'll see whether or not um, he can just bring you right up to 14 or 15 on the uh, Minotaur. That would be an interesting... If I could use Kale and him and Deacon to get through Minotaur without having to buy Masteries, that would be really nice. That would be a free-to-play dream, so we're going to try it. But if worst-case scenario, we'll probably buy. And I would think... Believe it or not, I would buy Kale's before Sun Wukong's. Because Kale, for Clan Boss, very important he lands those poisons. Whereas Sun Wukong, you're probably going to use him as a damage dealer to start. So probably less important. That's just my theory. Just, just kind of spitting. Um, I did on my last free-to-play account. My first free-to-play play account... We grinded them, and it was painful because I had to grind 13 because that's the champions I had. That's the ability I had. Uh, but definitely my last one, I bought two sets of Masteries, and it didn't seem to really hurt. And even on Amanda's account, we basically just bought her first couple. <laughs> I bought a couple more because, you know, when I go in and she wants help with the account, and I want to help with the account, but then I see that I need Masteries, so I'm not going to run minotaur so i apologize babe i think i made it up i bought her a few things I bought her a few treats on her on her uh, account so i hope that makes up for the gems i willfully blow let's see if we can keep going here uh 
And the reason why I'm doing this, I'm not doing any campaign farming. I might do some campaign, some catch up. So getting, uh, getting some three stars there for some resources. Again, my plan is Sun Wukong first. So I need the second I get Sun Wukong in to my team, I need to outfit him in the best possible attack gear I can. Probably lifesteal attack gear, but maybe not. Um, and then we'll then we'll run uh, we'll run him to fifty. We'll try to get him six star, and then we'll work on probably Deacon next, and then Kale third. Uh, just because Deacon is so like Kale doesn't necessarily complement Sun Wukong, but uh, Deacon absolutely does because of the decrease defense, which is such a, a, a great ability. So um, that's just kind of my thoughts, my theory. Shield guard will be, and, and I know some people are like, yeah, you don't need shield guard, you'll have Sun Wukong. But uh, the thought behind having a shield guard there to assist is I'll probably need him for Faction Wars. And I've never built one before. And he is absolutely a free-to-play play beast, right? No one gets a, a shield guard or no one is prevented from a shield guard. He's very accessible. You can book him with himself. Um, Death Hound's actually kind of a bit of a free-to-play gem too because he has that ignore shield and ignore block damage that uh, can be really strong in the uh, in the arena. Plus he's got a poison which can be useful. He's got very low health. He's a, he's a glass cannon, but you know, it's it, again, he's a common, so you should see plenty of them uh, in your time and be able to use him. Well, this isn't looking good. Get in there. Oh, look at that heal. Look at him heal himself right up to full. Not even flinching. Not even flinching. There you go. Oh god, but he's got the, he's got the big he's got the big hit lined up. He's got the hex. Let's kill him before that comes in. Yeah, we got it. Good, good, good. Is that eight? How far can we go? I feel like this will be the last one. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe not. Definitely the next Force Affinity one will be trouble. Uh, this one we might get good because we have uh, the weak affinity against my boy. Although, that's not good. Let's see how this goes. Probably should roll up that sword I got. That Lifesteal sword. I kind of, at first, always thought it was silly that we got two pieces of... Uh, or six pieces of life steal, and then because you only need four, right? But then I realized, like, hey, that that's that's one and a half champions with good life steal, or potentially better life steal. Yeah, the good weak hit, like seeing that. I think this will be our last one. Those weak hits are absolutely monsters for us. Yeah, yeah, good. We're gonna stop. We're gonna stop there. Uh, there's no point in wasting the. I can see that one that one weak hit on the big hit took like 40% of his health. If that was a normal hit or a strong hit, he'd be dead. So that's good. Let's see, where are we at now? Boom. See, like this. I, I could not collect this because it's energy, but I, I, you know, one, one of each type of life from Karak. hate this one uh oh well, whatever uh we'll, we'll run shield guard with you actually i'm gonna do we have any shield oh look at that he's already got masteries can already get that crit rate going uh i feel like we just want defense because he's a defensive based champ right um what's this three removes one debuff from this champion each turn oh it's a passive that's kind of cool attacks all enemies Tax one enemy. Two turn cooldown. That's what makes him so good, right? All right, let's uh, let's see what we can get for him. Crit rate. Look at that. The smooth sounds, epidemic sound, royalty free music, relaxing for your pleasure. 
I think I saw the link in the description down below if you wanted to uh, use my referral link. I don't, I think I get a free month if like five people sign up. It's nothing special. It's not like a special referral. Honestly, if you want to do something, here's what you want to do. If you want uh, royalty free music that works for you, if you're in any type of these sort of industry, you're doing YouTube content or, or, or Twitch content or any of that, go over to Deadwood Jedi. He's got a referral for another, a, is it Soundstripe? I don't remember of a different a different company but he has an actual referral that helps pay the bills so i would rather you go to him and support his endeavor than mine all right let's see well we don't want an attack whip what's this one looking like well Let's find out. That's that. That's that sword. I might have to give this to Kale, depending on how it rolls. Yeah, yeah. That looks like a Kale. That's a Kale. Uh, kale sword. If I've ever seen one before. Oh, that speed might be a problem though. I just finally got my Deacon to be faster than my Kale. So why wouldn't I double roll speed here to mix the balance to break the balance? What we didn't get though, we got crit rate. That's nice. All right, let's see. Oh no, but this is a. Uh, this gives me. What else do I have? So I just have another one of these. Oh, I won't use that weapon on him. I mean, it's kind of a, it's kind of wasted on uh, shield guard a bit. Oops, where are you, shield guard? But whatever. Defense. Look at that. I should probably take this to eight. Make sure I can actually level up all the gear I'm putting on. Probably the worst part about a new player account is a silver um i like putting gear to 12. i will put gear key gear to 16 because it does sometimes take like crit rate gloves in the early game are so important and it sometimes it can just take so long to get those crit rate gloves uh so i have no qualms at all about running uh running those to 16. it's Three or well, four star, I wouldn't do three star, but four star and five star, it'll last on your account longer than you think. Obviously, you want six star gear and eventually you're going to replace, but I, I think it's, I think people get scared to do these sort of things, and the reality is it's just going to help you. Right now, we should have some kind of, I don't even think I need speed boots. Do we have defense boots? That's what I like. There we go. We got a little mishmash of this guy. Absolutely no good substats. But, you know, whatever. Whatevs. Oh, I get the top normal chest in the clan boss today, too. That's a killer. So, uh, I kind of I kind of didn't talk much about it yesterday. Though I am curious to hear from you guys. What, what are your thoughts on the mythical champions they look amazing um they you can farm apparently hydra clash because it's not enough that hydra clash has given away stone skin accessories which then can have savage stone skin champions which absolutely terrifies me uh but now it's gonna have these these quartzes is that in the game yet is the thing in no it's not here yet okay like absolutely terrifies me absolutely terrifies me see like this is something i should have kept those energies saved but here, my worry is that i'll forget about them on the final day so uh so i end up just taking the energy not bad let's go let's check out let's see what we got top chest here boom warrior chest three star defense no we sell three star. We want four. Four star shield. Better. Probably not very good, but we'll keep it. So there we go. 
We'll come back to this. We'll run a we'll run a key. Okay, we have to win one of each accessory, right? Was that on a normal? Is that what it was? A normal. Alright, so we'll put you in. Wish Shield Guard will get him some levels. I also need to do this for the challenge. We need two of each, two more of each, because we have one of each, I think. So this might actually. Oh, we hit. Of course. All right, we got a sword. I can swing my sword, sword. Swing my mighty sword, sword. It's my diamond sword. So I don't know how the song goes. But it's right. We did not win anything there. This is just a neat way for Parium to use my energy. Boom. Oh, gotcha. Oh, good. Another one. Well, not that I don't need that anyway. It's all, this is all the food crunch, right? Uh, on this account, I'm absolutely taking one stars up. Uh, oh my God. We're taking one stars to two. We're taking two stars to three. We're not, none of it's food. It's all, it's all, oh, well, it's all food, but none of it's XP food. It's all chicken food. Oh my God. Four in a row. Where's the where's this RNG on my main? If I would have had that level of RNG on my main account, we probably wouldn't be doing this right now. Just saying. There we go. So what would you guys like to know? I guess that's a good question. To have. Oh my dear lord. What is it you would like to know about starting new what, what what can i keeping in mind that i don't have all the answers right i don't start new accounts all the time i'm I, i'm kind of learned in the game but i will say that often being and knowing the game can be a detriment because you tend to oh these two are in there you tend to um rely on old habits which may not be worth in current context oh good good thing i got another one of those right what i mean by that is you know i i rely on my great hall i i build champions a certain way that in the early game you can't necessarily you can't use crit damage gloves in the early game necessarily unless you get a good did i do did, did i do nothing right there when one each type of life artifact from clearing cards which which one did i miss Did I not get the boots? I feel like I, I don't know. So, you know, I'm curious as to see what, what can I offer in terms of, of information here? What would you like to see? I know what, see, I did definitely got the boots. So, um, oh, there, now, now it can't. Okay. Equip another champion with six life artifacts. Okay. Uh, he's got six. Uh, I, I guess you can have six. I mean, this is all just trash anyway. Good. I'd be curious as to hear what kind of things you think would be most helpful to free-to-play players. Uh, in the early game so we can you know obviously there's a there's a holding pattern right now and then there's a progression where it's just straight up do campaign uh, I did push dragon to seven or eight we'll, we'll take a look at that in a minute we'll do a recap of where we're kind of at and what kind of progression I did over the last 20 some hours uh, now we're doing just sewer or knock okay let's do that right now we're at 24 minutes that'll give this a nice under 30. Uh, video So what what have we done so far? Well, we did pull up a lot of champions and we did you see some two stars uh, We have some three stars now you see so we did a lot of that um, We did get a spirit host Luckily on our first run through on that. So we're gonna build her up a little bit at least 
uh, we're still sticking with kind of the core the core group here, which is Deacon. We did get Deacon three levels of Ascension, so that now he gets that extra turn. And we did get three levels of Ascension on Kale, so now he has the 5% poisons. Uh, we also fully did three levels of Ascension on Rocktooth, so that he gets the heal reduction. Um, when we need to, when it is important to. Now, I don't have any magic champions that need superior potions right now, or greater superior, whatever the best one is. So, like, even Kale, if you look here... Uh, he's still on the, on the, um, uh, I don't even know what these are called graders. So we don't need the superior yet. So I don't really need to push the, the, those dungeons and especially the spirit affinity. I will, which is another reason why it's good that I have, uh, uh, rock tooth here. We're probably going to have to take rock tooth up to 40. I feel so that he's survivable enough and can be in that encounter. The reason why is because. Wukong is a legendary spirit affinity. So he's going to need those top end potions almost immediately. So it's really important that I can actually farm those to any reasonable success. So that's why we have rock tooth. Uh, he, I mean, we won't take him Pat. We might take him to 50 if it feels like I, I just, I'm not getting a heal reduction though. I feel like there's a ton of heal reduction champions in the game, but the most we'll take him to is 50 and then use him for food at 50 um eventually when we need to so that's where we are with that um with the champions we have one book left on kale we have quite a few books with deacon no one else has been booked i don't have any dupes yet uh, as you can see upgrade skills i don't have any dupes here nope don't have any dupes here so those are the important ones that i would dupe out uh let's take a look at my dungeons i did not do anything other than dragon and potion dungeons and of course, you just watched, sorry, campaign. Uh, campaign hard, I kind of got to here, but I wanted to stop because I want to use Sun Wukong. Uh, so I did start going back to normal, and I started getting through and three-starring. And then I started doing some of the uh, challenges for books and some of the uh, some of the um, uh, missions. Sorry, some of the missions. So we're there, normal, hard, that's good. And then as far as dragon, uh, or sorry, dungeons go... We are Spirit Keep, we're at level eight. Uh, so we can technically get these. Uh, they are very difficult to get. So we probably want to progress further if we can. In order to do that, we're probably going to have to push Rock Tooth, like I said. Uh, Magic Keep, Sun Wukong can steal. I forgot about that. So that'll make this easier. Um, I haven't really pushed it much after I got Kale, his three stars and Rock Tooth, his three stars. But uh, we're obviously going to want to push this further at some point. Uh, we have two days left in the everything open, but I'm not pulling any champions. So as far as I'm in my head thinking, all my significant champions are magic affinity or spirit affinity. So I'm not really worried about force keep. We'll do stage five when we need to for missions. Void keep, won't need it for a very long time. Arcane, we're up to eight. Um, we, we just barely didn't make nine, but I think that was a while ago. So we probably could. You saw Labyrinth. I haven't done Ice Golem, uh, Fire Knight. Or Spider's Den, I have done the Dragon's Lair up to eight. And we did farm eight a little bit to get us some, some, uh, some artifacts that we can put on our champions. I mean, I'll test this, see where we're at with this thing. Shield Guard's weak affinity, so it's not like we can swap him in and get any further. Although he'd probably be better than Rock Tooth. The Rock Tooth does give the increased crit rate, which does help some of the champions that aren't crit capped, which I think is all of them right now. Maybe Kale's crit capped. That's not good. Yeah, kill yeah, kill the ones that are not important right now. That's fine. Oof. Yes. No. No. Okay, that's our that's our one forgiveness. Don't let don't let the fifty dollar champion kill us. Don't, yes, take away from him. Oof, yeah, see, that's what we didn't want to see. All right, they're all, we got the three main ones alive. Let's see what happens. If Kale can, yeah, so we did get the decreased defense. That's a big deal. Uh, we did get 5% ignore defense. We are landing some poisons, but we did not get his big one, his A3. And we weak hit on his decreased defense. That's not good. 
Kale, I'd really like to see you use that. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we landed one. Bunch of resistance. That's not good. That's probably going to be destined for failure. Yeah, this is going to be this is going to be a hard hard fail. Hard fail. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. So we know. Now we know. So that's where we are. I don't expect to do it too much more. I just wanted to get some basic gear on the champions to push potions in a little bit. And then we're just right back at campaign. Arena. Uh, I still haven't had anyone attack me. Which I need. <laughs> Please. Attack me and let me win. Uh, for the challenge. We need that. Uh... I think one of the big things. Epic books is going to be tough. It always is, right? That's a that's the one downfall of getting the uh, getting the free epic off the start, is that for him to be fully effective, you kind of need all the books, so especially on Deacon. But uh, so there you go. That's uh, that's us for today. Pretty smooth, pretty easy day. Comments down below. What can I tell you guys? What can I? What area do you want to talk about? What 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 topic could we talk about? on the next video uh, that's an ongoing thing just in whatever the latest video is let me know what you want to see in the next video as far as topics because i can play and talk about a different topic i can talk about hydra you know when do you want to challenge a hydra what does what do you decide when it's time as a free-to-play player when do you want to do doom tower all these like just if you if you can think of a topic to do with raid you want me to discuss it while playing the game here in the early game free-to-play let me know Otherwise, we're just going to chat and chill. So it's up to you. Oh, she's actually, she's scam I got scammed. She's level 50. She's a five star. Oh, mommy. I'm sorry. I did not mean to say bad things about you, Deliana. You're absolutely amazing. Get her, hit her, hit her. She's not amazing. She's easy. It's easy like a Sunday morning. Yeah, see, easy. Ah, that's why I didn't pick Deliana first. All right. Um, yeah, so that's, uh, let's wrap this up. Thank you very much. I appreciate you all for watching these videos, having a good time, just relaxing, playing a little free to play. I jump on the main account 30 minutes, sometimes less. There's a couple times I'd do a little more like this morning uh, because I knew I didn't have enough time to record this and then render and everything. I did do a little bit. I did insta battles of the, uh, of the uh, clan boss. And I did pick up some some clan quests just to do them. Uh, some easy ones for the forge so I didn't actually have to think about it. And that's about as far as I'm going to do on that till maybe tonight I'll do a couple more clan boss. But it's really nice to just log in there. Kind of do the stuff that's simple and quick. Oh, I also did Doom Tower auto battles while I was working. Uh, because I do want to get to Faye, right? Uh, I probably won't push Doom Tower if I have time, maybe. But I probably won't push Doom Tower on my main outside of this rotation because this is really Faye is really the the set that i care about the rest of the sets are, are eh, not that they're bad necessarily but i just don't need it's not my my need and i think you know if i ever come back to that account i do want to keep my my gear progression going anyway more than you needed to know thank you all for watching i will see you tomorrow i appreciate you all you beautiful sons of bitches uh please be kind be safe and we'll see you in the next video